This is Cossack National Park! So Wati Kat, it is your girl Monica and my friend Tessa and we have just woken up in Cossack National Park but we are not at the famous parts that you usually see we are at a hostel and this is where you kind of book your tours to go into like the actual national park and the lake and all that stuff. So we're actually literally about to go. That's why she's packing because we we're leaving in four minutes and then we're about to go stay in the overnight bungalow. So let's get it. This was our room for the night. Literally $9 per person. Private room. Let's go. <laughs> we did get a little free upgrade. We did. <laughs> Khao Sao National Park is located in southern Thailand and also known as Thailand's best kept secret. And the best way to get here is either by bus from Phuket, Surathani, or Krabi, with the most stunning feature being its lakes and limestone cliffs. The tour you book through your hostel should pick you up, stop for some snacks, maybe puppy time, until you make it to the pier to hop on a boat. We made it! Now we're about to get on the boat. Go to the bungalow. Woo! to the bungalows we actually stopped to explore a cave nearby and just like everything else in this video it was all included <laughs> into the price of the tour beautiful it's true also highly suggest not bringing any shoes yeah this is the move <laughs> like a free spa Ooh, i'm Ow. ankle deep i'm ankle deep <laughs> And then we were finally off to our remote bungalows in the middle of this lake. And these are our homes for the night. Here's a little sneak peek of what our little home looks like for the night. We have just beds and mosquito nets and obviously a window that goes outside to the beautiful blue water. And although there was no service here, it was a great opportunity to disconnect and enjoy the nature around us. It's actually kind of crazy that this lake was man-made, but the limestone cliffs around it make it this color and it is the perfect temperature. And lunch is included. <laughs> then we were off to go chase some waterfalls. Now we're doing a hike. about an hour one way just to go through muddy bamboo floors with tons of butterflies flying around us, crossing rivers, and finally making our way to what was the waterfall. We arrived! This is it! Honestly, it was just super nice to be able to cool down, but make sure to watch out for leeches. By the time we got back to the bungalows, it was pouring rain, but it made it such a vibe. It was so beautiful and so peaceful and just happy that we got to enjoy the water. Then we had some dinner and played some cards before we had an early morning. Good morning. We just woke up out of these fishnets. We're gonna see if we go to a safari or not. We got a peaceful morning as we are waiting for the rain to stop so that we can actually go on the safari. stopped raining so it looks like we're about to head to the safari <laughs> We had 
one last breakfast all together, but make sure to watch out for the bees because they're obsessed with the gym. Bye. After saying goodbye to the bungalows, it was time to make our way back. And the views did not disappoint, especially in my new favorite place in Thailand. They honestly fed us really well because we had one more lunch all together before saying goodbye to our Koh Sak National Park adventure. And that was Koh Sak National Park! Woo! We love it here! You have to come it's if you're so in good. Thailand. Yee. <laughs>